Fizz.org headlined this article just a few weeks back, From Butterflies' Wings to Bank Notes, How Nature's Colors Could Cut Bank Fraud. Apparently, scientists at the University of Cambridge were intrigued by the Indonesian peacock, or swallowtail butterfly, quote, whose wing scales are composed of intricate microscopic structures that resemble the inside of an egg carton, end quote. The article went on to say, Using a combination of nanofabrication procedures, including self-assembly and atomic layer deposition, Dr. Cole and his colleagues made structurally identical copies of the butterfly scales, and these copies produced the same vivid colors as the butterfly's wings. Dr. Cole seemed elated. Quote, we have unlocked one of nature's secrets and combined this knowledge with state-of-the-art nanofabrication to mimic the intricate optical designs found in nature. He also added that nature is better at self-assembly than we are, but humans have more materials to work with, he said. One application of this technology will be to encrypt banknotes, the article says, making them nearly impossible for forgers to duplicate. Dr. Cole thinks this may be what butterflies are doing. To some eyes, they appear bright blue, but to others, they appear green. The article says, This could explain why the butterfly has evolved this way of producing color. If its eyes see fellow butterflies as bright blue, while predators only see green patches in a green tropical environment, then it can hide from predators at the same time as remaining visible to members of its own species, end quote. Gee, isn't evolution a smart and wonderful thing? Of course, Dr. Cole did not explain how the butterfly could have evolved such a clever system, but they don't have to explain it. Don't you know evolution? Well, it just is. It's a proven fact. But perhaps this butterfly system was designed. The evidence for that is just as credible, perhaps even more so. But whether design or evolution, one thing is clear. Dr. Cole admitted, The shiny green patches on this tropical butterfly's wing scales are a stunning example of nature's ingenuity in optical design. End quote. Yes, Dr. Cole, it was designed. The evidence is plain. Thank you for using that word. So here is the continual silly pattern of Darwinism. The pseudoscience of evolution contributes nothing to a particular story except for a tacked-on, after-the-fact fairy tale about the butterfly mysteriously evolving some amazing capability for the purpose of doing something, with no explanation of how it did such a thing, why it did it, when it did it, or what it may be continually doing now. Even though human inventors, using intelligent design and modern technology, cannot even come close to replicating it. Yet we are to believe that a primordial soup, millions of years, some strikes of lightning and random chance, evolved this amazing intricacy of this particular butterfly? Astounding. Silly scientist, once again, you have unwittedly pointed the world to the wonders of intelligent design. So it seems, then, that we have a bunch of scientists pooling their ideas, combining their intelligence, purposely trying to figure out and copy the admittedly very amazing design that they observe in the butterfly. They used intelligence, purpose, physics, design detection, imitation, and human technology. And the idea that this butterfly somehow evolved this amazing ability by accident, even though human inventors pooling all of their intelligence cannot begin to replicate it in its perfection, is a huge leap of faith. Yet, this is what evolutionists want us to believe every day, simply because they declare it to be so. The unintelligent, directionless, uncaring, blind forces of evolved nature somehow used physics and then designed this state-of-the-art self-replicating technology in this butterfly? Congratulations on your faith, Dr. Cole. Silly scientists. <laughs>